Hey loves and welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, welcome. I hope you consider sticking around by subscribing. Winter and the festive season are upon us and I don't know about you but this is the hardest time for me to stick to my healthy eating plan. However, I have a few things that I do to make sure that I don't fall all the way off and I decided to share them with you. Okay, so before we get into the tips, I just want to put out a disclaimer. This is a time to be around family and to celebrate and to just have fun with your loved ones. So there's really no need to over restrict yourself in the name of I'm trying to stay healthy and maintain. There's no need to have an all in or all out kind of mindset, especially at times when you're supposed to just be letting your hair down and be free. So enjoy your time with your family, with your friends and your loved ones and just remember that it's okay to indulge. So the first tip that I am incorporating this season is not skipping breakfast. There's a reason why people say breakfast is the most important meal of the day because it sets the pace for the things that you're going to eat throughout the day. So if you have a healthy and filling breakfast, then you're most likely to continue on that path throughout the day. And if you're planning on going for brunch or dinner, you're not going to overindulge because you're not starving. So yeah, don't skip breakfast. The second tip is to pace yourself. Your brain takes about 20 minutes on average to register when you're full. So when you eat slower and you take small portions at a time, you're giving your body time to tell you to stop. So let's say you've gone for a brunch or you've gone for a buffet. Take the smaller plates, put in smaller portions, go and sit down, eat that, rest for a few minutes, then if you feel like you need to eat some more, go and take it. That way you actually enjoy your food and you don't feel like a panda afterwards. The third tip is to incorporate soups into your diet. I mean, it's cold already and who doesn't love a nice bowl of soup? They are not only filling, but they are nutrient dense and they are low in calories. So what's there not to love? Okay, so next I'm going to list three things that you can do to speed up your metabolism. And these are just small things you can incorporate in your normal daily routine that will just help you burn more fat. The first thing is tea or coffee. Try and increase your intake of tea and coffee throughout the day because it increases your metabolism by about 4-10%. to 10%. But don't be adding all those caramel, creamers, and sugar because that's just gonna add to your calories. I personally like mine black. Another thing you can add to your routine is a glass of hot water. First thing in the morning and you add either ginger or lemon. And again, throughout the day, as you're having your meals, instead of just having plain water, just add lemon or ginger and this will also boost your metabolism. Another food known for its metabolism boosting properties is chili pepper. So try and incorporate that into your meals as well. And lastly guys, water. Drink your water. I know you're going to be going to the bathroom every 30 minutes to an hour, but it's very good for you. First of all, it's going to curb your hunger, so you're not going to eat as much. And it can also boost your metabolism by about 20 to 30% for the first 30 minutes after you drink it. So the more you drink it throughout the day, you're boosting your metabolism and you're burning more fat. So guys, this is the end of the video. I hope you're going to incorporate some of these tips and tricks into your diet this festive season so that you stay on your wellness path. Thank you guys for watching and see you next Sunday.